hey, hey, what's up? My name is Jack of Kennedy, but you can call me Old Sport for short. Anyways, today we're going to be playing a new game called Playtime The Demo. <laughs> but for real though, my friend Smoose, yeah, her name's Smoose, she is the one who made the sprites of this game, and you know, me being her friend, I wanted to check it out. And from what I've seen so far, it looks pretty neat. So, uh, yeah, I'm gonna do a gameplay of this and tell y'all what I think. <clears throat> already, the time music's already kinda creepy. Good thing for a horror movie. <laughs> but, uh, <laughs> yeah. Let's check it out. Controls. The arrow keys are to move. Enter and Z is to interact with objects in the menu. Escape and X is to cancel and to open up the menu. So basically, RPG Maker. F5 is to reset the game. You got it. The lights will give you the clues that you need. Skip the cutscene. Nah. Ooh, it's like, uh, it's like one of those analog horror things with the VHS tapes. I like it. I like Hello it. Hello there. <clears throat> My name is Charles Burroughs, but you can call me Chuck. Suck, I'm Chuck. the man who founded this here company that you're about to work at. For real? We here at Big Smiles Toy Factory are all about bringing smiles to kids all over this great country of the U.S. of A. We don't only bring Big Smiles to our robotics, customers, is that you? but to our loyal workers as well. Whether you're working in our state-of-the-art assembly lines or vast warehouses, or you're one of our pencil pushers up in the offices, you bring a big smile to my face. Here at Big Smiles, we're one big family. Uh -huh. Now go out there and make your family proud. I, I see. Go out there and make your family proud. The big smiles oh, shit. office and factory is being shut down. So basically, five nights of Freddy's. I'm, I'm after kidding. The company founder, oh Burrows, shit, he did. Passed away due to illness. Oh shit, Another he did. Another factor that led to the factory closing <clears throat> could be years of numerous factory workers mysteriously disappearing. Oh fuck. The company denied any involvement in the disappearances of its staff. And yeah. no evidence has been found in support of any negligence. This reminds it me of Poppy's like Playtime, a uh, game I'm gonna be doing gameplay of lost their here soon. To smile. But uh, we're not here to compare and contrast. But this does give off the vibes that it's like Poppy's Playtime. I mean, it has the same title, just except Poppy. But I, I digress. I digress. Here is the sprites. Man, already Smooth's really outdone herself. She did a really great job making the sprites. <clears throat> <sighs> Four years of employment, right down the drain. Come in. For real though, Smooth really did a great job with these sprites. Hey, a boss! Almost ready to go? Seriously, I'd like to be out of here before the building is demolished. Easy now, Barb. We gotta make sure our business is taken care of before we leave. <sighs> Whatever. Ooh. I've been waiting years for this moment. What's five more minutes? Already, we got some plot. We got some. We got some characters. I mean, what we got so far seems pretty interesting. I'm invested. I want to see the full game. <clears throat> but, but for real, for real. I've been waiting years for this moment. What's five more minutes? S sorry, I don't know why, but I think that I'm actually getting sentimental about leaving. You're really gonna miss this creepy old building? I guess I didn't imagine this is how I'd be leaving this place. I always imagined I'd finally find my big break and do bigger things with my life. Honestly, I thought I'd be fired before Big Smiles came down. I'm surprised this place was the first to go. For real though, the sprite work is amazing! I was here the day this place opened. 
I remember being surrounded by all my friends as Mr. Burroughs gave a big speech before opening the doors. <laughs> he always treated us like a big family. He was real insistent that the folks who worked here were his own kin. Shame he never had one of his own. Smoose really did a great job on this. I'm really proud of her. Sal, if you're watching this, I'm fucking proud of you. You fucking ace the sprite work. <clears throat> yeah, yeah. The old fart cider checks. How tragic was he taking? How tragic he was taking us. Ta Fuck! I can't read shit. <clears throat> Let me start over. Let me start over. Yeah, yeah, the old fart cider checks. How tragic he was taken from us so soon. Can we hurry this up? I'd like to get on with the rest of my life. Careful, Barb. You don't want to end up disappearing on the way to the door. This place can still get ya! The animation's really tight. Shut up, Woody. All those lazy workers who disappeared just didn't have the balls to quit formally. Can't say I blame them. Y you really think all those people j just didn't show up? Nobody's ever seen them since they were last seen here. And nobody's gonna find them here. They, they no call, no showed, and that's that. If anything spooky was happening here. I would have seen some. Now let's get moving, Rima. You and Woody finish cleaning your offices. Barb and I will meet you at the exit doors. We all gotta leave at the same time, so let's all try to get out of here soon. See you in a bit. Ugh. I, uh, left something in my office. I'll go grab it and meet you down there. Sounds good. <clears throat> Do you believe, Joseph, about all those employees just not showing up? Some about them disappearing just doesn't make sense. I wouldn't think too much. I wouldn't think about it too much, Woody. Woody got wood. <laughs> what the fuck am I doing? Tomorrow, this place is going to be but an empty lot going to be nothing but an empty lot. So grab your stuff and let's get out of here. Right. Maybe it's best that this place is destroyed then. Oh shit, we got saves. I'll pick file one, I guess. <clears throat> alright, alright. Hmm. From what I've seen so far, yeah, this is pretty neat. I want to see the full game when it's done. So, devs, if you ever finish the game, just hit me up. I'll continue doing gameplays of this, because I'm hooked. Hmm, where is Woody? Woody, where are you? If this is one of your pranks, then you, well, I can't exactly fire you, well, uh, why is he like this? We can dash, right? Alright, cool. Cool, cool, cool. What the? Alright, Woody. Very funny. Unlock this door. I'm not spending all night here. Ugh, I'm so sick of these games. I'm over messing this place. Well. Yeah, it sounds like Woody's hiding in my office. Better get this over with. You know, most RPG Maker games, they allow you to interact with literally everything. Well, most RPG games I've played, but... Oh shit, is that a note? I want to play. Well, that's certainly definitely a change up from Woody's usual shenanigans. Rima got an odd note. Well, you don't say. Oh shit, we got skills. Heal, spark. There's there's combat in this game? There's magic? There's a magic system? 
Whoa, we got a fucking sword in an office, in a fucking office environment. We got a sword, a shield, a hat, and a cloth. Our stats are pretty low at the moment, but we got a sword. We got a sword, dude. We got a sword. So there is a leveling system in this game. I think. Is there? Huh. Hmm. Okay. Odd note. This looks a bit out of character, even for Woody. Alright. I can't believe we get a sword in an office environment. That's actually kind of badass. Change of music, I see. see him anywhere. Ah, there he is. Is that him? Or is that the BBG? Ah, uh, it's him. Ha. Ah. <laughs> oh man, you should have seen your face. <laughs> yeah, real clever. I feel like I've lost a year of my life. Sorry, I couldn't help it. I mean, now that we're all leaving, I just had to send you off with one final prank. Yeah, I hope you got your final laugh. We have to be ready so that we can meet up with Barb and Joseph. Do you have the key to the stairwell? Not on me. I just threw it on Mr. Burroughs' desk in his office. Let me grab my stuff from my desk first and then we can head off. The note on you the note you left was a nice touch. It wasn't from him. I have a feeling it wasn't from him. What no? Yep, I knew it. He didn't make the note. It was the BBEG. D don't don't play dumb. D -d that note on your desk in big blood. You're trying to prank me back? I didn't leave any note. Who could that be? Couldn't be Barb and Joseph. I'll see who it is. Hello? He's gonna fucking die, isn't he? Nobody's here. He's gonna fucking die. He's gonna... Is that Chuck? It looks like Chuck. It's time to play. It... It looks... It looked like it was Chuck. Is that Chuck? Well, it certainly is... Who I know it is. It's definitely the big bad evil guy. But... Oh shit! Chuck is dead. I killed him. Woody, who are you? Oh shit. Time to run, I guess. Get me the fuck out of here! My god, Woody, who was that? Is, is this another prank? No, it, it couldn't be. That was too real. Oh god, I gotta call the police. The line's dead? No, not now! I gotta hide. Uh, okay. For real though, this really reminds me of Pocky's Playtime. Even with the big BEG, it kind of reminds me of like a Puggy Woogie. But for real though, this is pretty neat. I like it. Again, I'm gonna do a gameplay of that later. But for now, let's focus on. Ooh, ooh, everything's turning gray. Why is everything turning gray? Did he spot us? Did I make a bad move? Nah, nah. It's cool. It's cool. I gotta get out. I gotta warn Barb and Joseph. The key has to be here somewhere. You got the stairwell key. He already organized the place? Holy shit. 
What has he been doing? How long were I in there? I will have to move in the darker areas and hope that he doesn't notice me. There might be some blind spots. It is risky, but it's worth the chance. I may even be able to hide in the bathroom. Oh, so that's what the bathroom was for. Heck, I can maybe even throw him off the side of my footsteps for running. It is dark after all. Coming this way. Ow, that had to hurt. Can we, like, juke him or? Well, either way, he's gonna chase me, so maybe if I, like, if I, like, have him follow me down and then I go around, that could be enough time to, like, escape him. Okay, I think I know what to do. Come on, come on, come on! Go, go, go! Oh shit, the key ain't working. Why isn't this working? There's something written on the key. Sorry, but this key only works in the full game. <laughs> oh shit, you're fucked. You are fucked. Full game? What the hell does that mean? You are fucked, that's what it means. You are fucked. Thank you for... Thank you so much for playing our demo. We look forward to bringing you the full story of Playtime, which we're hoping to have completed at least next year. Awesome! I can't wait to play! Any donations or exposure helps. Glad to be a part of it. Follow Playtime's itch.o page or Dylan in the Dark on YouTube for updates. Well, I got some news for you, Dylan in the Dark. D Dylan the Dark? Dill in the Dark? Dylan the Dark. Okay. I got some news for you, bud. I'm subscribed. <laughs> Game director, Dylan F. Writer, Dylan F. Game program. Programmer, Zachary S. Huh. See, character sprite sheet, Smoofs. My friend Smoofs, she's the one who made the sprites. So shout out to her. She did a really great job. Smoofs, if you're watching this, I'm really fucking proud of you. You really outdone yourself with this. Pat, pat yourself on the back. For real, I'm proud of you. I'm proud, of, I'm proud of all of you. You guys made something really neat. I can't wait to see the full thing, but... Honestly, I'm invested. I want to see the full thing. I like it a lot. <laughs> I like it. Uh, the, the game just ended. Huh. So, yeah, that was Playtime, the demo, and what I think so far, I like it. It has some really good potential, and I think this could be, you know, just work on it some more, and I'd say this would be something really neat. Uh, of course, there's some bugs here and there and whatnot, but that's obviously all going to be patched in the full game, obviously, but... From what I've seen so far, this is really neat. They have, like, a really good story so far. They got, like, they got the big bad evil guy down right. They even added, like, the analog for in the beginning with the beginning cutscene. I like it. I really like it. So, hit uh, Dylan the Dark. If you're, like, watching this, hit me up. I hit, well, if you're, when the full game's out, hit me up. Because I'd love to, like, continue making gameplays of this. This seems really neat. Um, but, uh, yeah, I guess that's all for now. Uh, hope you all liked the video, and, uh, be sure to check out Dylan the Dark on YouTube. Alright, later.